Good one. The world could be the vision of the one I see. A million dreams is all it's gonna take. There's a lot of things I want to be. Let's see a singer. That always gives away most energy. But I still got lots of energy. My husband came to me and he said, I really think that God wants us to adopt a child that's missing limbs, that would need prosthetics. I thought, wait a minute, you know, why, why don't we adopt a kid that I can help? She wasn't a candidate for lower legs. She's got no residual to hold on to or control prosthetics with. And her arm was pretty small and most kids with congenital arm amputations don't even use a prosthesis because they get so used to using what they have. When Tessa was one or two, she had to come to understand that she really wasn't going to have legs. And what did that really mean? One of our biggest fears, what is she gonna miss out on? But she kind of does pretty much whatever she wants for the most part. stuff I can't do like outside of the water so I like like learning new stuff in the water. They seem a little bit loose. She's really patient with herself and I think that's been something really special to see in her swimming. She has never expressed being frustrated that she can't do something. All right so when you're swimming follow the circles and try to do some side breathing okay? Ready? Set, go. People who are able-bodied will see someone who has a disability and feel the sense of sadness or pity even. And I love how Tessa just defies that at every turn. What really surprised us last spring, she had a goal that she wanted to try to pass a swim test that we have here. Most kids don't pass it until they're seven or eight years old. I come home from work and she tells me that she passed her swim test. And the biggest thing to me, I think, is just to see her independence getting stronger and stronger. And you can see on her face when she gets out of the pool. You know, she's so proud. <laughs> I just don't even know what the next goal will be. There's just really no limit to what she can do because once she decides to do something, she is absolutely determined to do it. A million dreams is all it's gonna take. A million dreams for the world we're gonna make.